What's up, YouTube? It's Mo Bay A76 signing back on, and what you're looking at is a unique Q500, 500 size drone. Got it sitting up, mounted on my Phantom 3, a hard case box. About to take it for a made of flight. Running at 1080p. This is 4K. So this is the controller. That's the drone. We are gonna fly it around. It's probably about five mile an hour wind, and uh, see how it handles. And we are in angle mode. Start the engines. See how this thing fly. Notice with this bird, you got to give it full throttle before it even moves. Flying real smooth. This is half throttle. Now this is full throttle. We are flying in a 42 acre field. Just testing it out still. You bring it down a little bit so you can get a better glimpse at it. Before this drone, I did have the Blade Chroma previous. When I was on vacation in Jamaica, and actually flew away from it. Last day I was there, so I went ahead and replaced it with this. You need Q500. Still think the Blade Chrome was a little bit faster, but I kind of like the black and like a uh, gunmetal silver. You get that black op look. This is the 2016 edition, so you see you got the blackout motors, 4K camera. I think the other gimbal was a little bit more fancier on the Blade Chrome versus the Unique Q500. All right, here's the controller. We're going to do a quick elevation and then a takeoff it's not that fast but this is good to get you going if you you, you don't want a fpv really with this thing this is more to shoot your videos and whatnot around the park there it is bringing it back been watching a lot of videos on this thing on youtube and it said it's real flimsy and likes to crash when it's coming down teeter-totter I'm not really having that problem I'm not going to even attempt to land it on the box on this first maiden flight I'm just going to take our time to land it in the grass and see how we get it done there it is fellas maiden flight 